Hey guys, hope you're doing well. In this video, I'm going to be showing you exactly how to print out barcode labels uh, for when you ship your products to Take A Lot. As you know, when you ship your products to a Take A Lot DC, all your items need to be barcoded so they can scan them into the system. Um, and if they're not barcoded properly, then uh, they're going to reject them and send them back to you. So whether you're selling on Take A Lot, Amazon, uh, or any other marketplace that needs barcodes, I'm going to show you an easy way to print out barcodes and stick them onto your products. Uh, let's get into it. Okay, so in order to download your product labels, you want to head to your seller portal and find the shipment that you're about to send through. So we've got the shipment here and it's for 11 units going into the Take A Lot DC. So what you want to do is come over here. We've confirmed the shipment already. So we're going to click on more and we're going to click on product labels. So you can say zero for this and press download. This is going to download our product labels. Uh, and from here, we'll be able to resize them and print them out. Okay, so I'm just going to click download and you can see that's downloaded. So the next step now is to actually open up Canva, C-A-N-V-A dot com, because this is where we're going to make the actual um, design for the barcode. So I'm going to go over here where it says create design and I'm going to do custom size and for the width the barcode labels I'm using are 40, let's just change this to millimeters. The width is 40 and the height is 30. So let's just press create design. Okay, so now we've got our canvas, which is 40 by 30, the same size as our barcode labels that we're using. barcode labels we're going to be using. They're quite a nice size and they're nice and small. Okay, so now that we've got our canvas made, we want to drag in the labels we just downloaded from Take A Lot. So here it is, product labels, and I'm just going to add these in. Okay, so we've got the file here. I'm going to drag it into Canva. And as you can see, it's added all 11, but we don't need 11 in one. We can just delete, uh, we can delete 10 and keep one because we're going to print this out multiple times. So let's just select it, make it a bit bigger, like that. That's looking good. And then what we can do is just space this text out, just so it doesn't block any side of the barcode, because the idea is when you send this to take a lot, they must have no issues with the scanning of it, and it must be one, some, one seamless uh, process for them. Uh, that's going to avoid your products getting rejected. Okay, so as you can see, I've resized it a bit. I've spaced it out so it's nice and clear. Uh, and what I'm gonna do is just drag it a little higher and now we're ready to, to download it. So you can go up here and you can click share. And what we can do is press on download. I'm gonna click download as a PDF. And let's press download. Okay, so now that those have downloaded, let's go and open them up. I'm just going to open with the preview. Okay, so we've got our label here. It's looking good. Let's go ahead and print it. So I'm on a Mac, but the steps on, the, on Windows are pretty much the same. If you have any questions, just leave a comment and we'll get back to you. I'm going to click File, Print, and uh, I'm going to have my label printer selected here, which is the Trophy T1. Um, and on paper size, I'm going to be setting this to 40 by 30, which is the same size as the labels we are using and the same size as the Canva file. So make sure that's selected. And I want to print not one copy, but 11, because we're sending 11 units to the DC. Okay, so once that's all done, we can go ahead and click print. Okay, so as you can see, our trophy printer is loaded up. We've got our barcode labels in, that's the 40 by 30 size. And I'm just gonna switch it on. Okay, so the trophy's on and it's ready to print. Let's go ahead and send those 11 stickers to print. So as you can see, our barcodes have printed quite nicely. And now we can just go ahead, peel and stick to the back of our items, ready for take a lot to scan it. Okay, so that's exactly how you go ahead and print barcode labels for your products to send to take a lot or Amazon. 
It's very simple, especially if you're using the Trophy Thermal Printer. Um, and if you guys have any other questions or anything wasn't making sense, then go ahead and drop a comment below. Um, apart from printing barcode stickers, you can also print your shipping labels for Take A Lot um, and for any other courier. So if you found this useful, subscribe and like, uh, and we're going to have more videos out in the future. Cheers.